Japan missile launch failed. On February 17, the Japanese H-3 rocket could not leave the launch pad because the secondary thruster did not work. During the live streamed event, H-3's main engine suddenly shut down after the timer counted down to zero, preventing the 57-meter rocket and the ALOS-3 observation satellite from leaving the launch pad at Tanegashima spaceport. The ALOS-3 satellite is also fitted with an infrared sensor to detect North Korean ballistic missiles. The Japanese space agency, JAXA, said it was investigating the cause of the failure. Japan built the H-3 rocket to boost its autonomy in space technology and gain a larger market share from rivals like billionaire Elon Musk's SpaceX. The rocket is designed to put government and commercial satellites into orbit, as well as deliver supplies to the International Space Station. Under the cooperation program between Japan and the US, the next rocket versions will deliver goods to the Gateway Space Station that NASA plans to establish to send people back to the moon. The US promised to give Japan a seat on manned lunar missions. Mitsubishi Heavy Industries, which built and managed the H-3 launch, hopes the rocket will serve its space ambitions, given SpaceX's successful rocket launches with reusable rockets. Applications, including the Falcon 9. According to a report by the Center for Strategic and International Studies published last September, the cost of each Falcon 9 launch to low Earth orbit is $2,600 per kilogram, while the cost of launching HLL, predecessor of the H-3, up to $10,500. With the H-3, we want to cut the cost per launch in half, a Mitsubishi heavy spokesman said ahead of the launch.